In a lawsuit that was filed earlier this year, Tamar Braxton's backup vocalist accused the reality star of assault. Krizian Rock is responding. Krizian has refuted all of James Wright Chanel's accusations, which include that he endured many physical injuries, extreme mental anguish and severe emotional distress, as well as physical pain and suffering, according to paperwork that In Touch Weekly was able to receive on Monday, October 7th. She said that James's own conduct, actions, and or omissions caused any pain he had, hence he is not entitled to any compensation. As previously mentioned, James alleged that during Tamar's performance in Los Angeles in November 2023, Krizzy and Rock attacked him backstage. James first filed a criminal complaint against Rock in January. A month later, he filed a lawsuit in which he claimed to have been hospitalized with slashes on his face and two damaged teeth. She struck him in the face several times without any justification at all. Wright Chanel's lawyer remarked, We were shocked that she was allowed to leave the facility that evening. She was wearing rings that resembled brass knuckles in most cases. The reality TV actress allegedly got into a fight because she didn't get to rap during the performance. The lawsuit alleges that in addition to the attack, Rock called Wright Chanel a homophobe. Krizzy and Rock quickly proclaimed her innocence in November, pointing out that there was no video of the attack. Her friend, who was at the performance, asked on Instagram Live, why try to lie and say nobody told you she was about to perform? Why did they make me give the DJ her music? And why did she have the microphone? Make it coherent, please. Why even instruct her to pull up, enter the stage, and do other things? In a subsequent statement regarding the event, Tamar said that Wright Chanel had indeed been beaten.